TOF People Counter Installation and Configuration Guide Packing List Installation Guide Take this channel as an example for installation demonstration. Measure the installation height, the height from the ground to the surface of the device. Measure the width of the doorway and confirm the installation position in the middle. Mark the bracket installation position with a marker. Drill holes at the marked position and use four self-tapping screws to fix the bracket to the top of the channel. Install the device, use four 304 hexagon socket screws to fix the device to the bracket. Connect the DC-12V power cord and network cable to the device. Or connect the device directly to the PoE switch, which can be powered and connected to the network at the same time. Installation completed. Configuration operation steps. First, connect the debugging computer and the device to the same network. The device static IP is 192.168.31.100. Manually set the computer IP address to the same network segment as the device IP, such as 192.168.31.101. Log into the configuration page. Open the browser and enter the device IP. Go to the configuration page login interface. Enter the account and password to log in. Homepage preview settings. Open various display functions in the preview settings. Height settings. Open the rule page and fill in the installation height. The detection button can directly detect the installation height. You can manually fill in the installation height. Fill in the maximum target height, minimum target height, and child filter height in turn. Counting strategy settings. Draw the detection line. Click the Draw Detection Line button and move the mouse to the depth map on the left to draw. Click the left button to start drawing the starting point, drag the mouse to draw the line, and click the left button again to end drawing. Click Save in the lower right corner to complete the drawing. Click Draw Detection Line. Select the detection line and drag to adjust the position and then click flip arrow direction. The direction of the vertex in the middle of the detection line is in and the opposite is out. Save settings. Draw the wandering filter area enable according to actual usage. First enable the wandering filter function. Each detection line corresponds to a wandering filter area. Click the draw button, draw in the white box on the left. Click the left button to draw the starting point, drag the mouse to draw a line, and click the left button again to draw the second vertex. And so on, until the box formed by all the points wraps the detection line. The wandering filter area can eliminate people who wander around the channel entrance but have not actually entered or left. Prevent duplicate counting. Click the right mouse button to end the drawing. The wandering filter area needs to wrap the corresponding detection line. Click Save in the lower right corner to complete the drawing. Draw the detection area enable according to actual usage. Under the Regional Detection, click the New Edition button. 
Click the left button to draw the starting point, drag the mouse to draw a line, and click the left button again to draw the next vertex. Click the right mouse button to end the drawing. Click OK in the lower right corner. Fill in the passing through filtering time and minimum residence time. Click Confirm to complete the settings. Other settings enable according to actual usage. In other settings, turn on the functions of child differentiation, employee identification, heat map, and timed reset. Data push settings. Add rules and data reporting. Fill in the reporting name, server address, and server port in turn. Push the data to the smart retail cloud management platform through the server address and port. Click the connection test button. Proceed to the next step after the test is successful. There are no special requirements for other options, just fill in the defaults. Time setting. Open the time configuration in the system and set the business hours of the device. Note, the device counts normally during business hours and non-working time is not counted. Settings are completed, save settings. Data Statistics Chart The configuration page also supports data statistics functions and provides a wealth of charts and data reports. Supports display of data according to the time dimension of 5 minutes slash half an hour slash hour slash day slash month slash year. It can also export data. There are four types of queries. Number of inspection lines. Query the number of people entering slash leaving each detection line. Pull in detection area. Count the number of people in the specified area. Residence time. Query the stay time of people in the specified area and the corresponding number of people. Heat map. It can query the sports heat map and heat retention chart. Heat map function uses color blocks to intuitively display the density of crowd movement and the distribution of stay time. Assists data analysis and optimization. Accuracy test. After the device is installed and configured, you can perform an accuracy test to check whether the data is normal.